GitHub Copilot Chat. Do you know that it's possible to use GitHub Copilot Chat in a GitHub Enterprise to support you to analyze your repository in your browser? Hey, my name is Julia Ruda and today I would like to share with you a little bit more about GitHub Copilot Chat in the GitHub Enterprise. But uh, for today I will talk about the repository analysis because we can use GitHub Copilot Chat in the GitHub Enterprise tier to use this to analyze and understand commits, uh, pull, uh, pull, requests, uh, pull requests I have said in other videos and explain your source code directly in your browser, okay? But before to go to my screen, let me to, to, to request one small thing. If you are not subscribed to my, my, my channel, please click in the subscribe button, uh, click in, in the bell button to receive a notification about new videos and you can choose if you watch or know this specific video that I will be releasing my channel in the future, okay? And don't forget to click in the like button and comment in this video, okay? Well, I'm, uh, I'm in my repository right now, okay? And the idea here is show for you two features or two approaches that you can use GitHub Copilot Chat to interact with your repository, okay? The first one is going to my commits uh, screen, okay? In my commits, I have my commits list. I have three commits in this repository because it's a, a, a very simple repository for for another video that I'm uh, working for, okay? And here I have these three: initial commit, test, and broken. What I'm doing here, I will be click and chat with Copilot beside my my, my um, login picture, okay? My profile, and here. I will be asking for my copilot what my com commit does and I will be pasting my commit ID. Basically, uh, the GitHub copilot will be understanding my commit and explain for us what it does here. Basically, I have two modifications in the bank account uh, class and a program class uh, causing a, a type of er error explained in more details. And here, when I ask it about more details, uh, we can see here uh, a parts of the code that changed the lines comparison of the, the previous and the new version of the code for each class and a description uh, about what I did here. It's a very, very interesting because imagine that you need to analyze a big repository to understand one specific change. You can use the GitHub Copilot chat to explain each commit and you don't need to open each one properly to see the diff files, to understand the, the, the changes. You can use this to, to understand in more uh, readable and more natural language interface to understand. I think it's a very, very uh, better approach to use to analyze our comments. Uh, I, to me, it's a, a, a game changer for me because I need to, to analyze sometimes uh, my comments list to understanding what happened if someone did something wrong. But using this, uh, it's making my job very, very easier. I don't know what, what you think about it, but to me, it's very interesting, okay? But it's not the only feature that uh, I'd like to talk about today. Uh, it's uh, only the first part of this video, talking about the comments ana analysis, but we can do another thing uh, in your repositories with GitHub Copilot chat. Let me delete this chat conversation, close this, and I'm going to my code page, and let me open uh, a bank account class, okay? Imagine that you are analyzing your repository or another repository for your project, for your company, and you have no information about that, or you have no knowledge about uh, what source code does. And I'm here in this class and I would like to know what this method specifically does because imagine that it's not so clear to me uh, what I can do here. I can click in the line number with the shift, shift button pressed and I can select all lines of this method, okay? Now, when I click at this, uh, my, my, my lines will be uh, marked as selected with uh, um, a little yellow line in my case, and I have here a co-pilot icon. When I click this, it will be open a, a, a new screen, a, a new chat bot here with GitHub Copilot, as we said before, but in a difference, have attached here 
as a file uh, my lines, my source code lines, my, my block code that I selected before and I can request explain me the codes and the GitHub Copilot will be understand and generate an explanation for us and we can for example request make its code better and in my case GitHub Copilot will be analyzed and make me a suggestion to transform this code to make this code better for example and here I have a new suggestion for my updated code, in in, uh, in my case it's uh, suggested I entirely code, but I have here a new suggestion. Basically, we can use a GitHub Copilot Enterprise to analyze your changes or commits or our source code file to support us in our days. It's a very, very interesting and to me it's a, a little game changer because uh, it's increased our productivity to understanding all points in our source code. Uh, commits, uh, div files, or um, uh, uh, source code properly. If I'm working on a different project and I need to understand uh, a package source code, for example, it can be a very hard in, in normal ways, but using this, it transforms my life, it makes my uh, life easier because I can understand this in a readable uh, information in my uh, natural language and uh, we can interact the, about this uh, retrieve more explanations, more suggestions, improvements uh, the sky is the limit for me basically it's a very interesting, I, I don't know your opinion I, I'd like to hear your opinions if you have opinions to share with us, comment in, in this video it's very interesting and very, very important for us Okay. well, it's all for today I, I, I would like to know about uh, what you think about that but I hope uh, to you like it, don't forget to click in the like button and I hope to see you in the next video, okay? Bye bye!